yes, uh, some of the key things that have made me and I believe makes marriage to succeed is patience with each other's weaknesses. Nobody is perfect, that like we have all seen today. It will appear that there is no fault in Sam, no fault in my daughter Deborah, but when you become intimate, that is when you begin to discover little, little things. It may even be the way one places somebody who is 100% perfect that can fit into your life. Once you understand that, you will go a long way. Then secondly, there is this beliefs about particular issues in life. She, they, of course, they are from a normal background, but say, having said that, the social background also differs. They should put that in context and then deal with each other. Once you do that in marriage, particularly, I, I, I appeal to the general public that when you marry or you're in marriage, understand your backgrounds and then bear with each other. Culture and other things are also important, but above all, trust. Don't, you know, don't always suspect your spouse. When he or she says something, say, is it true? Don't ask that question more than twice. It brings doubt. So those are a few but strong points among the things that has made me to be in my very precise, very, very precise. Thank you, my dear. Thank you. I appreciate you.